Hey traders, this is episode 14, Trading Ideas, 20th January 2017. I'm going to only explain on uh, pound sterling dollar, I mean pound sterling uh, versus other currency pairs like pound sterling OD, GBP CAD, GBP strike, GBP N, GBP Newton dollar, GBP Sing dollar. I got exotic uh, pairs, GBP, uh, Danish Krona and few other currency pairs. So let's look at the GBP OD. I'm only going to explain about GBP OD on this video. Okay, let's let me discard the key levels. Okay, let's look whether the where's the trend is heading. You see, from this point, market created high, created a lower low, lower high. See lower low lower high created lower low lower high market created lower low lower high with there was a very good confirmation here then it moved all the way down then also limitation market created higher high higher low higher high higher higher low the market reversed so all the price action traders they were anticipating market to retest this level because there was a market reversal so they were anticipating up to this level then a lot of sellers because you see still it's a very clear downtrend you know broken retest a lot of sellers entered and buyers defended the price and they brought it higher so a lot of sellers entering the market so buyers defending the price above the key level impulsive move sellers entering aggressively then market was pushed to the lower point so now uh, bias so since, since this is the lowest point let me mark the key level okay so this since this is a key level this is a monday gap okay market open and close higher and retesting and this is the upper key level and lower key level so what uh, we can understand from this price action story is overall market is very clear downtrend is it downtrend downtrend so what and how we should place our position is if at all it closed lower and then drop then it's a very clear downtrend but what market have done is it created a reversal here okay what we can anticipate is market retest up to 1.6866 is this area it has a potential to reverse downside higher because overall it's a downtrend but at the same time market have formed limitation and created a higher high and forming a second retest so this could be a bullish signal also i mean that means dollar is going to weaken overall if you ask me for today i see more dollar weakening sign here and on top of that look at the liquidity is reducing the the, the there's an inside bar in this is inside this this is inside this this is inside this so the liquidity is just uh, drying up because Trump's uh, first day so we anticipate more upside pressure and since this is a uh, quite uh, important day I would rather I recommend you guys to observe the chart observe the trade but do not take any position because it can be very volatile even it's going to break upside probably it really create like 100 pips down and 100 pips up then only it can just uh, take the direction okay this is the straight so on the daily chart this is what we we can firmly say it's going to be upside pressure 70 percent is going to break higher that doesn't mean it's confirmed going to break higher there are chances for it to break 30 uh, below 30 percent so higher percentage on the high upper side 
So I hope you guys understand that. And uh, on H4, you see, it's a very clear price movement. You see, market create a very clear downtrend, lower low, lower high, lower low, lower high, lower low, lower high. It created higher high, higher low. So now what happened is it's, it's the liquidity is just drying. Uh, upside pressure is it's anticipated to create a higher high. So that means a lot of buyers going to come in. They'll be targeting up to 1.68. You can uh, take the figure round, round number 1.68. Okay, so we can anticipate up to this. Overall, it's uptrend and um, on H1. You see, even you look at a price action on a, on a core basis to the core. Look at the candles. What is this? Very good two bar reversal. Lot of pain bar. Two bar reversal. This is most significant compared to the downside signals like pin bar over here for down sellers. For sellers. See not so this is engulfing bar. So the bias one is more significant. Correct? So we can anticipate up up upside pressure higher. So if you look at a uh, pound selling on a bigger scale, it is a very clear downtrend on the long term. Whatever I'm saying is a very short term, very short term. We can see a downtrend continuation further. There's no reversal sign yet. And uh, we haven't covered the Brexit reversal also, you see Brexit. And um, they've got another 2,800 pips to be covered, which uh, when I think this year we're going to cover that. Uh, even this this point is, is okay. This is significant also. So market will retest here. So if it retests, that means it's going to be 2,000 pips. You can enter a trade like a weekly traders because we are looking at a weekly chart. Uh, like um, like like um, you enter here and then your stop loss like what 700 800 pips and your target is 2000 pips so you only look at the chart every week Monday oh sorry every week Monday to uh, yeah every week Monday to make your decision so you'll be holding the trade for a couple of months you know probably like two months three months so assume if you're holding a weekly trades, this will take at least. If it's moving uh, in, a, in a straight line, aggressive mode, probably about a month, two months, one and a half month, but six candle. So if it's slow, you know, like range in between, then it's going to take about close to five months to six months. So it'll be interesting if you can try. Uh, try uh, probably if you have a five hundred a thousand dollar account, you can put zero point zero one and and put your stop loss at seven hundred pips, which is going to be like um, seventy dollar. Your gain will be come two hundred dollar, but you can hold your trade for for five months. This is a very good practice to you know to train your to enhance your self discipline because most of the traders won't have uh, patience to hold the trade that period of time so this would enhance your skills so if, if you're afraid you can try always can try demo icon first okay thank you tra uh, traders safe trade